Hello guys, welcome back to Ventilate. And guys, I am about to jump in. Jump into the deep end, guys. That is what is going to happen. All right, let me get as high as I can because I am a greedy, greedy man. I am so greedy. Give me that money. Give me that money. Come on, bro. Come on, just hit once. Come on. So the problem is when you haven't played it for a while and you jump back in and it thinks that, you know, it, it's gone up to the point where you can prestige and get your item. Uh, however, your, your heroes are not even close to where it is. I, I, fine, fine, fine. I'll let you win this time. Let's jump into it. Come on, come on. Please do not have any whales. Let me be the whale. Let me be the whale. Come on, what do you guys reckon? Ew, real. I've seen this guy before. Where was he from? Where was this guy from? He seems very familiar. I swear he used to be in the same clan as us. He, I don't know, he looks very familiar. Wait, 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 he's not my clan member, is he? No, 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 he's got an Aussie flag. Well, I don't even know, that's very weird. I have definitely seen him before. I'm pretty sure that I have I'm very confused right now. He, he seems very familiar. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if he used to be in one of the clans that I was in. Um, or it could be either the American Patriot or um, what, what would it have been? That Taiwanese group. I think he was in the Taiwanese group. And I know this guy's pretty sick as well. He's not. He's not crap. He's good. He's really good too. Hmm. What's the Necro? What's this bad boy's Necro level? 313. Three. Damn, that's pretty high. Look, I might actually get beat by this guy because I know this guy is quite a badass. He's not just like some normal, crappy little, you know, useless guy who's got nothing on. So I might actually lose to this guy. So, hey, if I lose to him, he's actually not the worst because, you know, he's, he's kind of like a mate. <laughs> I mean, losing to a mate is actually not, not a bad idea, right? Because at the end of the day, he's still a mate. So, hmm. Just very interesting. It just it just looks so familiar. I I can't tell why. I'm pretty sure we've been in the same clan before. Anyhow, anyhow, guys, I am so sorry. I went on a tangent there. My my mind just spiraled out a little bit. It just spazzed out. Absolutely spazzed out. I, I could you know I'm trying not to swear because it's on a video you know and and it's I don't know if you can or cannot. I, I'm not really sure with YouTube and I I know you guys have definitely heard me say one or two words here and there but I, I try to keep it as PG as possible so that at least it's kind of like you know somewhat uh, teenage friendly if that makes sense you know um, no, teenagers swear anyway it's just it's, it's a joke uh, the world's gone very sensitive but thankfully hopefully there's been a bit of a change you know that they get rid of all these DEI whatever S S E I V E E A I you know all these policy crap and um, let's hope you know, it's gonna get a little bit better for the world. Um, make the world a better place and happier place. A place where we can laugh at each other and definitely call out the stupidity of each other. So I think that's absolutely amazing. So that would be the best place of a world that we can live in. Agree to disagree and call each other out for each other's silliness and just move on. You know, life, life is a lot more bigger and a lot more simple than that. It's, it's actually a very simple big life. Um, that, that, that I mean, that's what I think, you know, my philosophy is that, hey, as long as I'm doing well, I'm taking care of my family and we're having a great time, why not, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a, such a better place in this world, it's not only for all these stupid wars and all this crap around, you know, I think, I think I was listening to Joe Rogan's podcast and he was talking about the fact that everyone wants to feed their family and everyone just wants to take care of their family in the very core of who they are, right? And even the ones that have really bad family history and background, they want to take care of their own brothers and sisters or the people that they are with because everyone just wants to take care of their own. Um, and I think, why can't we just do that together? You know, why can't we just, even if we don't like each other, hey, you know what? Let's not even be next to each other. And I think that's not a bad idea. You know, just fine. That's why we have borders and that's why we have countries and that's why we have languages and that's why we have rules and that's why we have laws and that's why we have very, very different ways of seeing things in life because this is how it is you know we just have differences and it's okay to have differences 
And, you know, differences bring out such beautiful things. I mean, not to get too deep about, you know, history and stuff, but if you look at China, right? Most of these bloody Chinese people come out of China anyway, and I'm one of them, right? I came out of, I don't know, my ancestry probably came somewhere out of China, went to Malaysia, grew up around there, and I came to Australia, and now I'm in Australia, and it's just, you know, I, I'm ethnically Chinese. But then if you look at the differences that have made over the thousands and thousands of years, and you look at the Japanese history, you look at Taiwan's history, you look at Korea's history, and you look at Vietnam, you, we're so much more intertwined and together than we think, you know, and I think the world can be a better place even with differences. And, and that's why we visit each other's countries because of the differences. And I think that's absolutely amazing. So uh, life can be, we can have our differences and I think we can still live with each other. And, and from time to time, we will have some conflict and I think that's normal. But yeah, the less conflict, the better. You know, I'm very anti-war. You know, I'm not, not a hippie or anything, but just, just very, very anti-war, you know? I, I would die for this country and, and defend my family and defend this country, but there ain't no way I'm going across some across a sea to fight for some stupid war. And I think that's a very, very important thing. And so, I come back to Tap Titans too. And that's why I'm doing this, because I find it such a good distraction from all the craziness of life, from, from the economy to interest rates to inflation to all the doom and gloom. I find that this is a place that I can find a bit of peace you know, just within my hands and within my, my you know, pocket and I, I can just pull it out and have a little bit of fun and just forget about the world. So hopefully you guys enjoy this kind of content, you know, and the reason, I'm just kind of giving you the reason why I actually play this game is so that I have a bit of a distraction from the craziness of reality and, and yeah, that we can just, you know, come together and enjoy this game. And even if we have differences when we talk about it, I think it's not a bad idea. Some of you like Path Build, some of you like a Clanship Build, some of you still old school and playing Shadow Clone Build. And my favorite is Heavenly Strike, but it, I, it, I don't think it's gonna do well. So that's why I don't do it, you know? Um, so yeah, we can all have our differences. And I think that is the beauty of life. And even in this game, I, I, I just really love Tap Titus too. For a mobile game, this is an exceptionally great game. I, I know I've said this a lot, but I'm just telling you, this is a great game. There is no way can, someone can make a video on this game so many times. Uh, and, and make hundreds of videos on this game and still not get bored, you know? Um, there are times it does get a bit tiring, you know, trying to make videos and come up with content, but it is not boring, if that makes sense. It's, it's just more of like, huh, oh, I, I just don't want to, you know, just keep continuing making the same kind of crap. I, I want it to be something fun, you know, something that we can all enjoy along the way and, and that we can kind of interact and have fun together because all you can do is type a little bit you can't even put emojis in, in the chats and stuff within our clans so even clans become very quiet because it, it, it is pretty awkward it is it's just texting you know there's no feeling you know so hopefully this kind of brings out a bit of feelings you know brings out a bit of joy uh you know get behind you know the, the people that are behind the screens and i bet you there's so much more interesting people out there uh, that do play this game as well and so yeah anyways guys that's a good plug to actually jump onto our discord you know and there's, a, there's no need to, there's no money, no nothing. It's, it's just join, have a chat, and talk to each other and connect with each other. And I think um, if you enjoy that kind of um, chat, just definitely jump in. And if you like helping people, there's a lot of people that's always needing help. And I think it's a great source of um, a way that we can connect as a community. So yeah, that's it guys. Well, I, I am at number one for now. I, d I don't know how long I can be. He's not at 7,500, which means he hasn't uh, clocked up to the next level yet. So. Hopefully I can beat him with this by outpacing him and hopefully these, this will just stay the same. We've got 22 hours and five minutes. So it's probably another couple of hours of people that may join um, at the end. So I might get in second, I might get third, but I'm gonna try and hold on to first place and let's see how this tournament goes. So hopefully all of you have a great start to the midweek. Uh, it's hump week today. Uh, it's bloody, bloody, bloody hot in Australia today. It was up to like 42 or 43 degrees Celsius. It is just ridiculously hot. Um, but yeah, I think tomorrow is gonna cool down a little bit, thankfully, and so yeah. Hopefully everything's going well with you guys anywhere around the world. Hope you're all staying safe and everything is going good. So if you don't mind, guys, drop a like, drop a subscribe, jump onto Discord, and I'll catch you at the end of this tournament. Bye-bye.